my name is Elijah. I am 21 years old from Palm Springs, California, living here in Brittany, France as an au pair. I have been here for about a year already. February 22nd was my one year mark. So it's definitely been an adventure, uh, some good, some, you know, some a little disappointment, but uh, like every adventure, it's definitely been educational and adventure of a life, adventure of a lifetime, <laughs> sorry. But I hope you enjoyed this little clip I'm going to put together for you of uh, my two families that I was with and why I decided to change families and um, the times that I've had here. So Enjoy. my first family lived in a little city called Bon Plage. They were a great family of four children and the two parents. They were both doctors, so very, very busy. Uh, unfortunately, it didn't really work out with the first family because they were too busy. I was constantly uh, working overtime. I worked a lot on weekends and if I wanted to leave on a weekend to explore or to do some things on my own, it wasn't really practical for the parents. So they relied on me a lot. So with that being said, it was kind of difficult for me to have that educational experience of brands and you know really being able to uh, see different parts or even to speak French was a little difficult because when the parents weren't there, it was just me and the children and it wasn't very easy all the time. So uh, in June, I decided to look for a new family and I was going to part my ways at the end of the summer so that the new, my current hosting family at the time would have time to receive a new au pair. And so that did work out and I found a new family and I moved in with them the beginning of August when school started. Um, so as I said before, I never really had a horrible time with my first family. We did have some great experiences, great adventures, etc. But uh, just didn't work out. Unfortunately, wasn't my match what I was looking for here in France. So that's okay. That's totally normal and it happens sometimes. But here's a little slideshow of um, my time being with the family. Enjoy. I love you more. Hello. Thank you very much. Thank you.
When I found my new family, it was definitely more easygoing. This family was had a normal working schedule, so they were home a lot to be with their children and with me to teach me and actually have a, a cultural exchange because when it's just the children, it's not really easy for them to explain how things work, etc. And so it worked out so well. My new family is totally understanding with weekends um, being time for myself they understand that you know being with children all week long can be a little exhausting and it I do work really hard at my job so they completely respect and support me doing things on the weekend um yeah so usually on the weekends I spend them with my boyfriend he lives about uh, 45 minutes from where I live now so it's not too difficult to get there and back. I would take a train, maybe 30 minutes, or uh, he would pick me on his way, pick me up on his way from school. So that also worked out. I, uh, with him, we have a very um, unique uh, relationship because us being from total different sides of the world, we both teach each other so much. I am learning constant French with him, of course, and he is. Uh, improving his English also with myself. He speaks fluent English, but uh, as every uh, normal person, uh, mistakes are made and I'm here to help him as he's there to help me. So it's a great exchange. Even on the weekends, his mom uh, really encourages to share uh, the French cultural or even the region cultural uh, foods and desserts etc and it's really cool because they also enjoy to try some of my American cultural or Mexican cultural um, foods so it's really interesting and I love that part of my adventure here in France. As I did with my first family I'm doing it again with my second family. Here's my last slideshow of uh, me and my adventures with my second family here in France. And that will be the end of my video here. So enjoy. Bouge my yard. 